Hey guys, Charles here with D2APDesigns.com and um, I was going to show you guys a Cinema 4D tutorial. Um, I'll go ahead and play this video in a second and show you what we're going to do. Um, I got a lot of requests for this so here it is. Um, what we will be creating is this right here, this little abstract object. I don't know what you'd really call it. But um, I got a lot of requests for uh, that, so here we go. Open up uh, Cinema 4D, and uh, we'll go to our objects and open up a platonic. Uh, we're going to go to Octa, and Segments, put it to 2. And uh, we'll make this editable. Uh, go right up to uh, Selection or excuse me edit select all hit I on your keyboard for inner extrude make sure preserve group make sure preserve groups is unchecked and then we'll go ahead and hit apply of course we are extruding it the wrong way um, I would go to about two on it two and uh, let's do 1.5 see how that looks. Eh, we'll, just, we'll go with that. And then we'll go ahead and hit D on the keyboard. Go ahead and hit D on the keyboard. That brings up the extrude button. And we will extrude it about... Let's do two. And then hit I again. Brings up the inner extrude. And let's extrude it out. Mm, really this is all preference um, decide what you like um, that's a little too much I think oh that's definitely too much let's do 1.3 let's try that let's see how that was eh, still too much let's just go with one yeah we'll go with that okay and then uh, once again we're gonna go ahead and hit D and we will extrude this one more time um, yeah that'll work obviously this isn't exactly the same as the one in the video only because I don't remember what dimensions I used so you can see the gaps and everything are different you know it's extruded further out or actually it may not be extruded further out but anyway it's slightly different but you know that's the basic idea of it and then um, if you want to get it on its side, type in 35 for H rotation, P rotation is also 35. And then B, I put 45. And there we go. So that's how I created the uh, little abstract object that I used in that video. So I hope this helps you guys out. Maybe, you know, not necessarily creating this, but maybe creating something else. So uh, that's it, guys. I'm out of here. Peace.